is 5.29 in the fucking morning. What's going on, guys? But by the way, back at it with another fucking video. You know what I'm saying? I hope you guys are having a great day as always. Today we are starting the video early as a hell. You know what I'm saying? If you guys don't know already, though, it is 5 in the morning, obviously. But if you guys don't know already, currently I've been driving the black car. For a lot of people who don't know, the black car is an annual car. So, it's always fun driving that car. It's like, it, it's cool to mess around in and drive with and stuff. What I had planned was that I was going to take the doors off that car and drive around with it. But, I found out that it is illegal to do that. So, we are not doing that. So, enough of me talking. Let's get straight into this fucking video. We are at 7-Eleven now. Or where's some eleven? I don't know what to get. Every time we come to these stores, I don't know what to get. It's early morning right now. We're gonna work, like I said. Um, there's a lot of drinks. I don't know if I should get an energy drink. Like something from here or something from here. I tried these. They are not that good. They're not that good. That low key, I think I made a quake though. That's cool. I dropped my wings. I finished one size of pizza and all my wings. I don't care what anyone says, and anyone who gives me a shout out to you, you know what I'm saying, but 7-Eleven pizza and wings are so underrated. If you guys haven't tried them, try them. They're actually so fire. And I got a Quake, you know what I'm saying? Right now I'm just drinking a Quake. What we just got here? Let's go work, and I'll see you guys after. Bro, call me mid-vlog. <laughs> Anyways, I just got home. But alright, you guys should have seen that. Okay, so at that last house, the creepiest shit, kid you not, happened. And I swear on my life and anyone's life that I swear to God, I saw a ghost. I'm not kidding. Like, I saw a legit ghost. Like, I, like, okay, so what happened was I was in the house and I walked in to do the windows or whatever. So I walked in and there was a guy in the living room. I kid you not. He was like a little bit taller than me. And he was, he was a bit older so he i walked in and i seen him i looked at him like one time and then i just walked back because it's usually what i do like i look around and see if there's anyone in case like you know because sometimes i have two headphones on but in case there's someone i take one headphone off and i put it away and i keep the other one on in case they talk to me or something so i don't just ignore them because then they might think i'm rude or something and i don't want them to think that but anyways so yeah i saw a dude so i took my headphone off uh, i started doing the windows and he was talking to me and stuff and then he left he left that room and went into a different room. So I also left uh, the living room, went into a different room. But the guy never came back out of the room. I came back out, went upstairs, and I was talking to the guy's sister. And pretty much she was telling me how she got a, sis she got a house with her brother and stuff um, because she had gotten divorced a couple years ago or whatever. So yeah, pretty much that's what happened. I was talking to her and then she, I, was, I was like, oh, okay, yeah. I was just talking to him downstairs and she's like, I w she like was confused. And she's like, my brother... My brother uh, passed away years ago, and I was like, my when she said that, I was confused. But then, like, everything started like jump into place, and my heart dropped. I was like, I was like, wait! But I swear, I just talked to. Him. She was confused as hell. So was I. I walked into the restroom, and immediately I texted my girlfriend about what just happened. And I was so fucking creeped that I want to get out of the house. I'm never going back to that house. Keep my word. I am never going back to that fucking house. My package. <laughs> Am I allowed to open it or do I have to wait? Are you sure? Let's see when Nicole got unboxing video. I never thought I'd be an unboxing channel. All right, let's just hope it's in the right angle. Yeah. Oh, there's some sick packaging though. It's like the Apple thing. You know? Made by Apple California. Designed oh, by China. Oh no, that's not how that goes. Damn, dude, feel this bottle like. You know when you feel something, you can just feel it's new? That's what this feels like. Oh, it just feels you. new. <laughs> you see this Lego Supra? I have it in real life one day, watch. I'm gonna have, I'm gonna get a Supra one day in real life, and I'm calling it right now, watch. I will have a Supra one day, watch. All right, well, I'll pick up the video in a little bit. We're here getting gas in the black Honda. Now I'm saying gas be expensive as hell. But we're about to fill up like 25 bucks of gas. Cause the good thing is I already have half a tank, so we should be good. If you guys didn't know, right now we are going to the car meet, which is permitted 100%. You know what I'm saying? Everyone's got their permits. Everyone's got their permits. They're gonna be drifting on the street and stuff, like at an intersection. We should be good. All these uh, 
all these people that are drifting, they're all professionals and stuff, you know what I'm saying? So we should be good. I still gotta go pick up one of my other homies. I go pick up Edgar, you guys have seen him in my videos before. And then later, I'm gonna pick up Hyder, you guys have also seen him in my videos before. Like I said, right now, we're gonna go pick up uh, Edgar, and then we should be on our way to the takeover. So, I'll see you guys in a bit. Well, we're here at the first spot with this dude and this dude. You know what I'm saying? This car's still pulling up behind me. You know what I'm saying? I was debating whether to park on the street or the park. I guess we're just gonna park inside the park because everyone else is parking here, so. There's a lot of people coming here, though. What are your thoughts? Huh? What are your thoughts? Hood rat activity. <laughs> Get up close, but I don't know. I don't want to get hit either. Fuck that, because the last time, the last time we came with one of these, dude, we almost got hit like three different times. That shit was bad. Dude, I don't know what the fuck hit my hand, but like, it was like fucking warm hot rubber rocks or spark. I don't the fuck hit my hand, but dude, something hit my hand, that shit fucking hurt. <laughs> Damn, cuts are here. Cuts are here. I don't know if he's waiting for us to leave. Look at this dude. <laughs> Come on, dude. You gotta hurry up. Well, anyways, like I was saying, this is all permitted. I don't know why the cops are here. These are all, these are all professionals drifting. You know we have a permit. Hey. We have a permit. <laughs> this is all permitted. These are all professionals. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, we're going to Santa Ana. I'll see you guys at the next spot. Well, we are at spot number two. We are in Santa Ana. Like I said, though, this is all permitted. These, the, everyone here has permit. These are all drift pros. <laughs> I remember when that happened in my car. They had a push start. Fuck, that shit was ass. Dude, that's what I mean, though. You never know with these cars, bro. I thought that shit was gonna hit me. <laughs> oh, no way. No. Dude, they're filming. They probably got his plate, his license plate. We gotta be careful. It's a Mustang. He might hit us, bro. We gotta be careful. <laughs> And there's a helicopter. My bad. Oh Where's Edgar? Where is he? Oh, he's right there, bro. Hurry up. Let's go. Oh, shit. Get the fuck out of here. Dude, they said some got ran over. No oh, way. Oh, shit. Did somebody, did you see it? No, I just heard someone yell it out. Holy shit, dude. Dude, they came out of nowhere. Dude, that shit was sick. That shit was, low key. Holy shit. There was like five cops. To be honest, dude, did we have to run, bro? Holy shit. shit. Dude, that car came out of nowhere. That G was still trying to run even after he got caught, bro. Did you see that? Yeah. Dude, he, dude, he was trying to juke the cop. 
And then people started getting in. They were trying to run in front of the cop, bro. That's crazy. I Holy wonder if somebody shit. got run over. That shit was crazy, though. Holy fuck, dude. Honestly, this shit fucking, dude. That shit was scary, dude. They all came out of no. I thought we were gonna get trapped, low key. Yeah, because there were so many, dude. How come nobody said anything? It was right behind people too. That's what I'm saying, dude. I don't know. Anyways, I think we're going to Costa Mesa. Um. Yeah. I'll see you guys in the next spot. Well, we are at the spot, and there is one cop here. He's in the distance. You can barely, barely see him. They're all saying block it off. Look at all the smoke. Well, it looks like I can't do much right now because my car is fucking smoking. It's um, overheating. We just have to wait for it to cool off. It'll be fine. It's way too hot. So we're just waiting for it to cool off. You know what I'm saying? We can see the takeover from here. What? It's the fan, it's running, it's both fans running. Which is good though because now I don't have to disconnect, I don't have to connect the battery anymore, which is good because the sensor, that means the sensor for the fan that automatically turns on is working. We had to replace that. So now that means it's working, so at least that, no? Dude, this shit's fucking popping off, bro. Holy shit. That shit popped the fuck out. Holy shit. Well, we have run into a major, major catastrophic event. We are stranded once again. No, I'm just kidding. We're not stranded. But the car is smoking once again. The car is smoking. It's smoking from here, though. This specific piece. So I think I need to add some water to the radiator, which in turn will help this whole solution. I just need to wait for it to cool down. And then we're gonna go pick up the other homie that's gonna come with us along for the journey, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah. And my car is sick though. Everyone low-key thinks it's a sleeper though, cause look, everyone like, everyone's just staring at my car every time I drive by, like everyone just stares. It's fucking funny, but yeah, it's got two different rims though. Look at, look at that rim. And then we got another rim on the other side. Boom. The other one got taken off. It had two of these. I had one on this side and then I had one on the other side, but the reason the other one got taken off was because, but it was on wires and the shit popped. So now I'm out rim. We're gonna buy some cold water right now, bro. You know what I'm saying? I need cold, cold water. It's two bucks. Oh, now we have a gallon of water. Boom, now we got some cold water so that in case my car overheats or tends to overheat again, we have cold water. What's going on? Right by the way, I am laying down in bed next to Nikki Yam. I am officially going to sleep. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and please subscribe if you guys haven't already. I hope you guys are having a great day as always. And with that being said, bye-bye.